Where am I? Are those roots? Nah, <laughs> can't be. Oh, this must be one of those those prank TV shows. <laughs> All right, be cool, Max. You're gonna be famous. Hello, everyone, and welcome to APN Gaming. My name is Jared, aka Cornfed Kraken ninety three. And while I usually stick with my wrestling series, I always like to do stuff a little bit different. With popularity growing on the channel, subscriber counts going up, you know, this, I like to try things out, see how things do. So how long will the series go on? Well, that's up for you guys to decide. If you guys like this series, leave a like down below, comment, engage in the video. I really, really want to see your guys' feedback on the video. I'm sorry, I'm still fighting with allergies. This is going to be a little bit more laid back series, but I'm definitely looking forward to playing it. Right as we explore, I will let you guys know that if you do have a fear of spiders, you may want to just be careful on what we're doing and when we're doing it, because there is spiders in this game. And they are pretty creepy. And I'm not even afraid of spiders in real life, but... I mean, I think it's common that nobody really wants them climbing on them, but I really, I, I don't really have that big of a fear of them, so. All right, so we're collecting a bunch of supplies here. Some sort of radio signal? I wonder where it's coming from. Radio signal. So I do know something about this game. I'm sorry, like I said, my allergies are wicked right now, but, uh. So, I do know a little bit. I have played through this first section uh, on my own before. But they've added a lot since the last time I've actually played this game. And I want to say that you can... Oop, I did not want to throw that. Yeah! Okay, well, I did anyway. Okay, I kind of like this perspective. I don't know how you guys feel about that as a perspective, but I, I do kind of like it. The only thing that I don't like is the HUD size. Can we... I don't think you can change the HUD either. Alright, so we got a bunch of supplies here. We're just collecting a bunch of stuff. We got some sprigs, some fiber, and we can analyze a lot of this stuff as well. Got some mushrooms, those we can eat. They do fill you out pretty good. I mean, they're not horribly great, but they're not bad either. All right, let's collect some of this stuff. And in here is a science station well, we can analyze. Someone stuff. had to have set up all this sciencey stuff here. So but fiber's still, probably going to be I'm one not of the exactly big sure things where this is and what is going on. I should keep looking around. So right now we learn crude rope, fiber bandage, and plant slurry. Plant slurry is a new thing, I believe, for me. So you can only do three things at once, and then there's a countdown on when you could do another one. So we'll do a sprig, too. These are going to be used for a lot of things. So we got spiky sprig unlock, trail marker, roasting pit, sprig fence, and plant fiber as well. Even though we already had plant fiber. And these little red icons, well, that'll tell you whether you researched it or not. I do want to research sap, but I think the more important one is a pebble right now. They're kind of the common things. We got a spear and a pebble axe learned. All right. So now we got eight minutes and 54 seconds before we can use that again. There we got an ant, a red worker ant. So, yeah, let's start crafting up some of this stuff. There's a weevil. Hey, buddy. Clogs now. 
<laughs> Those are neat. All right, so let's craft up a couple of things. So, what can we make? We need a spear. It looks like we can make that right now. A spiky sprig. We need thistle needles for that. And I believe you need a level 2 axe. I'm not 100% sure. Like I said, things have changed quite a bit. Let's make a couple of crude ropes. It's a speedy little green So now all we need is one sprig and then we can make the axe, which is going to come in handy. All right. Yep, there we go. So I think there's a way inventory, yeah. So I like my stuff a certain way. I'm odd like that. All right. So now we got our axe here. We'll take that out. So I believe these... Is it a dandelion? No, I don't think it's a dandelion for thistle. A dandelion will get you weed stems and a tuft. So we need to find like a thorn bush. Well, before we do that, we'll come up here. Whoa, look at the size of that ant. Honestly, I'm just glad it's not big enough to squish me. There, we need that gnat. Wow, what is that? Gnat fuzz comes in handy. I hear another gnat. Where are you? I hear one buzzing right here, but I don't see him. Oh, there he is. Is that Nat drunk or something? Hey, it's coming right at me. Yeah. Oh, Hawk. <laughs> They're nice. He went and really sunk way down in here, didn't he? There we go. We got some Nat fuzz there. So we don't want to drink this water because it's pretty gnarly but we do need some water do we have some right here handy so there's certain blades of grass that if you look for those of you that haven't played this before I'm looking I don't see any you also gotta be kind of aware of our surroundings because there could be a lot of bad stuff here All right. Okay, it's making a liar out of me. I don't see any. Oh, there we go. See that water droplet? So I think what you can do is you can either hit it like that, which that didn't work, or you can kind of hit that block. That will fall, and then we can drink that, and then our water's come up quite a bit now. All right, let's head back towards the center because this is kind of the main thing. All right, so let's hit this Showtime. button. <laughs> Just so it like wants us to check dad. these lasers. Nothing happened. There's one here. Looks like that the other two lasers are blocked. Locked. After all that build up, we'll this big this mysterious down. computer doesn't do anything. Man. Yeah. Those are gonna give us some planks. Although we can't put those really in our inventory, we can carry them. We're gonna kind of stick those up here for now. So now we just got one more over there to do. I'm trying to think. I don't know if we can make a torch or not yet. I do know that there is something over here where we can get thistle. So we're going to see. I'm kind of curious. It's this one, I believe. Nope. hear something oh it's something underneath the ground okay so I know there's a thistle plant somewhere oh that's an orb weaver so there is a thistle plant somewhere over in here I'm not exactly sure where oh I think I is that it you gotta be careful because there was an orb weaver somewhere here there's some ants. Okay, this is new. There's a hot dog here, and I believe this is where the old thistle plant used to be. 
So yeah, I think that's new. Dang it, I was hoping to come across a thistle plant, because those would come in handy, because we can get the thistles to make arrows. Yeah, there used to be one right here, but I think they must have moved it in one of the newer updates. So it is what it is. Uh, that orb weaver's over there. We don't want to get too close to him. This game is pretty intuitive. It has a lot of different armor sets that you can get. Uh, they give you different perks as well. Oh, is this the thistle plant? No, that's a dandelion again. It's where they look similar. All right, well, let's go back to that science station and see what we can check out now. Let's cut down this because this is dry grass. Which is also something else that we might need. There we go. We're just going to take one of those for now. We'll head back to the science station see if we can do anything with this. Alright, let's analyze. Let's see. Let's do... We got three of three. Science. Okay, we did get a torch unlocked that time and a bunch of other things. Pallet, plank pallet, stem pallet, plant lamp, sap sconce. We did level up too. So we got a bunch of things from leveling up. Pebble hammer, first armor set. All right, so I think I'm going to say Natfas is probably pretty important to you right now. And then not only did we unlock crude rope when we did fiber, we can analyze this and this will also give us some more stuff. Acorn shovel, eye patch, and canteen. There's some more brain power. So let's go in here. We'll craft up a a torch. Let me see. Where is it? Right there. So we need one crude rope and two more grass trunk chunks. So over here, we'll just cut down this. All right. And then we can come over here. We'll make our torch. There. I th can we move these in here? I don't think so. I think we have to come into our inventory. Because I kind of like things set up like this. All very quickly accessible. So we're heading over to the station. We got to clear out some mites to get that laser to work right. And that'll be end of this first tutorial mission here. There we go. You see them eating that stuff. I have a bunch chasing me right now. There's a mite dead. There's a ton of them right here. Mites are pretty good for resources. And if you can if you parry them just right, they give you it gives you like an extra bonus. There we go. Let's climb this. There we go. Mite infestation. My aiming was better. There we go. And then this dark tunnel. I did not have the timing there. 
All right, let's see. I'm not picky. I think that'll help heal me up a little bit. There we go. Pick up a couple of these to analyze as well. I think we did unlock the ability to make a hammer. Let's see. I need another peblet, another sprig, and another crude rope. Let's go see if we can get that. So we're kind of at the end of this. That laser should be going strong now. Be nice if we can make that hammer. There's a peblet. Some fiber. A couple sprigs. I'm going to grab a couple more. You can never have too many resources here. All right, let's see. Do we have enough to make what we need? Yes, we do. We now have our hammer in there. Did I throw some? Oh, no, it was telling me to go back. Okay. All right, let's head back down here. And we should be able to get some of this quartzite. Or quartz, whatever it is. Yeah, quartzite. I believe that's made for repairing and upgrading and stuff like that. And the blacksmith. Alright. There's a ton of it in here. And there's our first scab. Well, there's the first mission pretty much almost done. Let's head back and hit that laser. And then we'll be pretty good on this first part of grounding. There. There's all kinds of base making and everything. Oh, there's a thistle plant. There's bees above me. Okay, so I think these work now differently. Where you can go up and down these and collect the thistles. This is great. We're going to have a bow in no time. Oh, keep falling down here. All right. So we got quite a few. All right, now let's head back towards this machine. Yeah, so that was a thistle plant. Those are gonna come in handy because we can make some arrows now. Which is going to make us more of a range combat instead of up close. Right now we only have a spear, so. And we should be able, all beams are good. Let's activate it. something that sounded like a big far off explosion nope don't know what you're talking about so i believe i could be wrong but i think Aww. when you analyze not not sure if you lose this when you analyze it or not let me check grass plank so we got quite a lot of stuff there learned And I'm not oh, sure. It's getting dark. Should probably find somewhere to crash. A lean to right there. So we need three clover leaves. So there's clover up over here. Yeah. Oh, 
requires a chopping tool. All right, there's three clover leaves. All right, so for now we're gonna build this right here. And we can use this and we can set as our respawn point in case we die. And then we can also come here to sleep when it gets actually nighttime. So that is going to do it for this first episode. This wants us to craft a fiber bandage. Can we do that while we're right here too? Fiber bandage. We need plant fiber. I think we can. Let's grab a couple, two, three more of these. And that'll be that done. So we have a pretty good start right here. Now we just need to go investigate that explosion. And we'll do that at the beginning of next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are liking this series like I am, leave a like down below, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Like I said, I'm not going to be giving up the wrestling series. I just, I like to branch out and kind of try things new, see how things work. And with the player base, I mean, with the subscriber base growing, maybe you guys are interested in something like this. So if you are, let me know down below and we will see you guys next time right here on APN Gaming.